Uh, Josh Green here for Tungsten Tales, joined by Jermaine Watamina. Jermaine, um, season so far, I mean, it's been a little bit different to any other season, but we've seen plenty of pro tours. How has it been for you so far? Um, thanks for having me, uh, Josh. Um, still so far, yeah. I was going to say uh, not many tournaments at the moment because of the qualifiers, of course. And um, yeah, I think it is not the start what I want, but um, I'm happy how I played. And um, the most of the people know that my priority one was lost some weight, get healthy. Um, yeah, and I know that I will qualify for the match play later this year, mm -hmm. in July. And hopefully uh, the next pro tours will be good, good as well. Yeah, we'll talk a little bit about your weight loss. Why, why did you decide to make that decision to lose so much weight? Um, because everything will be uh, more easier. Um, and my, my overweight was too much. And I don't feel fit at the moment. And I was, I was thinking about, you have to feel fit. Uh, start with, uh, with uh, healthy food. Um, I lost some weight. And... Uh, I, the, the 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 pro tours. I see in myself that that I not tight anymore after the match. Mm. Or when you have to play some games, a uh, few games on the day, is better. Feels now better than before. Yeah. So you were saying just before it's twenty eight kilograms, just over four yeah. stone, in what four and a half months? Did you say? Yeah, I started January and it's now May, four and a half months indeed, mm. and um, almost five months. Mm. And I will keep going uh, with it and hopefully lost some more weight. Yeah, I mean, in the Pro Tours, you talk about them, they're really long days if you make it to the latter stages of playing six, seven games. How important yes. is the fitness at, at the latter stages? I think it's important because um, we, we are going to bed to wake up early and we have whole day to, uh, to play in darts because it starts mostly 12 or 2 o'clock and maybe you are, when you hit the final, semi-final, I think you're busy for four and a half, five hours, maybe longer. Mm -hmm. And you need that energy to uh, stand up for your next game. And I feel that, um, of course, I did, did well last few years. But I feel that really the difference. Only what I feel now is the balance is different. Because when you lost some weight, then um, your balance is a little bit uh, out. Yeah. I can say that, yeah. Yeah. But I'm still practicing. Um, practicing is still going well. And hopefully I can uh, do that on the tour, next tour is our practice. Yeah, I mean, what is your practice routine at the moment? I'm not sure what the situation is at the moment in the Netherlands. Are you able to practice with other people at the moment? Um, yeah, you're able to practice only uh, official with uh, one person. Mm -hmm. um, but not, not, in, uh, not in the pubs yet. No. It's not allowed in uh, Holland yet, but uh, it's a combat more practice. Um, yeah, my day is... Uh, more than um, I woke up, I go for uh, interval training, just run and a walk yeah. uh, around the 10 kilometers. Then I come to practice for one hour and a half and a little bit relaxed and one hour more practice. And then I going to see if I want to more practice or not. Mm -hmm. But most of the time I, I, I try each day, three hours practice. Yeah, oh, very good. We need to talk about the last pro tours over in Germany couple of good yeah. result, decent results for yourself getting to the last 16 um yeah. last results of the year how was it being over in germany because usually you, you'd have to have to travel over to milton Keynes or maybe even barnsley or wigan but what's it like being over in the continent and obviously a lot of the english players weren't weren't so happy about that but it must be easier for you yeah um my opinion is that's good uh look uh, we have always, always traveling to England as well. Mm -hmm. And 
and Germany as a part of the European Sea Europe, of course. Yeah. And it's good for them that they have some pro tours because there's no Europeans to work for. Uh, I, I don't know how long now with this. About a year, I think, since we've had one. Yeah, exactly. And it is a good thing to come to, uh, to Europe. And it's everyone's decision if they will come over to Germany or come over to England. And my opinion, I will. I want to play darts, and I will. When I have to travel to, I going to travel for it. Doesn't matter how, if I test or something like that, and I can I go through and all. Yeah, how difficult has it been traveling over to England for the Pro Tours and last year as well for some of the majors and the World Championship, it's, of course. Yeah, it's it's the traveling is alright. Um, when you have a negative test, then it's no problem. Only you have to uh, take the train or the car. And I think now oh, the flight is going well now as well. Yeah. And uh, next pro tour, we, we can uh, take a flight to England. Mm -hmm. That's not that problem. And when we're in the hotel, we could test as well again. And then we are in, the, in a bubble. Yeah. So we'll just touch on the tournaments coming out, the World Match Play and the World Grand Prix. You're currently in those spots. I think there's eight more Pro yeah. Tours before the cutoff for the World Match Play. Um, yes. I'm sure you'll be looking to make it a little less nervy towards the end of those because it's very it can get very nervy qualifying for those big tournaments. Yeah, I don't think about uh, any qualifying for the World Match Play because I won't play my game. Mm. And I know uh, I'm more than 3,000 um, ahead on number 17. There's, yeah. uh, there's a good position. Yeah. But we will see, as, as I make it, I will be very happy with uh, making the match play. And because, yeah, because this year is uh, what I told you, our priority one was, of course, losing some weight, getting fitter, feel healthy. And I think that's extra boost to hit the match play then. Do you think that'll help you on a, because obviously it's a very long format at the match play, first to 10 in the first round. Think that's yeah. something that'll help you at the match play? What do you mean? In terms the, of weight loss and be, having the extra energy over a yeah. really long format. Yeah, of course, of course it will help because uh, my, my breath's not longer in, uh, when I uh, play or walk or, um, you have to imagine in January, I couldn't walk 100 meters, or I couldn't run for 100 meters, and I can uh, run now for one kilometer and a half. Yeah. And then with interval training, I walk, run, walk, run. Yeah. And that's safe enough about uh, about healthy and the fit I feel now. Yeah, it's a, an incredible change. Um, you're actually, you're number 28 in the rankings now and well inside the top 32 but the results on tv probably haven't been what you wanted over the years do you feel as if one or two results on tv could really get you going towards the top 16 where i'm i'm sure you want to be um yeah at least i got for myself one result to the quarterfinals of the grand prix yeah the grand prix of course yeah but hopefully there are more coming up and i know uh, it's more in me, but um, what I can play on the floor sometimes, I'm playing uh, last, last year is really good on the floor, uh, only on the TV, it's not coming that out and hopefully it will. Mm. What do you think you can do to bring out the game that you've shown on the floor? What can you do to then bring that out on the TV and show your best performances there? Um, yeah, what I can do is practicing, of course, and maybe get my mind on the stage and on the thinking, come on, it's a fluid tournament, what you can do on the floor, you can do it on TV as well. Yeah. And maybe a little bit of pressure on myself because uh, I'm playing most time well on the, on the TV tournament, but I lost, of course, the, the, the matches and that's... Mm. Does it give you the confidence on TV tournaments? <laughs> no, you've, lost, you've lost a lot of good games over the years, especially at the World yeah. Championships. Yes. Um, just finally, touch on what 
what are your goals for for the rest of the year? I've got a lot of majors coming up. Where do you want to be come the end of 2021? Uh, of course, in the top 32, I hope, because it's a difficult time for defending from prize money. Yeah, This is hard working to uh, still win the top 32. I can't afford it. And then after this year, hopefully, uh, the corner fights will be uh, less now. Yeah. Uh, I think England is better at the moment, because in England, the vaccine is, uh, is good on its way. Yeah. And I think that we next year, when it's not like Germany like this with coronavirus, that we play more tournaments in England, I think so. Hopefully. Hopefully. We all hope so. We all hope that there'll be more tournaments coming, especially Euro Tours next year, because we, we really do yeah. the Euro Tours. Yeah, at, at least my opinion is now, um, as you see, that you now have can, can some have crowd in England. Why not? We cannot um, play some Euro European tours in England. Because can put some crowd in and mm. and hopefully, hopefully it will do. Hopefully, and, we, all, we all hope so. Yeah, it is hard. It's difficult for the PDC as well. It's difficult it's, uh, for the players from around the world, of course. But we will see, and uh, I hope the best in the future that we have the, the normal tour back and uh, enjoy again our games, and of course for the crowd. You can see the games, see the players, see his favorites. And um, they, they are so many welcome. I play um, tournaments a better crowd than without crowd. That's more, the, the atmosphere is much better. Because hopefully the crowd will come back soon uh, over the world and we will play uh, some nice tournaments as well, like the Euro Tours TV tournaments. I hope so indeed. Well, thank you very much for your time, Jermaine. Really appreciate it. And we'll, uh, we'll see no you. Problem at